Good morning, Brooklyn, and welcome to Rosewater Pavilion. Uh, this is one of four of our hospitality spaces at the Championships Wimbledon, uh, named Rosewater after the Venus Rosewater dish, which is presented to the winner of the ladies' final. Today, we've got uh, some recipes, some uh, of our wonderful cocktails from this space. Alex from Tin and Glass, our mixologist specialist, will take you through all of the different recipes so you can create those wonderful cocktails at home uh, and enjoy at your leisure. Okay, so the first cocktail that we, uh, I'm going to show you how to make now is the cucumber and elderflower sour. So I'm just going to take my rocks glass and fill that up with ice and just set that off to one side. We're using Sipsmith, the official gin of Wimbledon, and we're going to use a 50 ml measure of the Sipsmith gin. Then we're going to take 25 ml of fresh pressed cucumber juice. For the citrus, we're going to use lemon, so 25 ml of lemon. And then to balance against that, some of that citrus, we're going to add just a little bit less, about 20 ml of elderflower cordial. So a real British summer drink. Then add ice into the shaker. And give it a good shake. And now strain that over the ice. And then to finish, garnish with a cucumber ribbon. There we go. And there you go, Nick, cucumber and elderflower sour. Superb. It's quite early in the morning, but let's try this. Oh, that's super delicious. Really refreshing. Beautiful summery drink. Made. It's one of it's one of the most popular in the rose water this year for sure. I'm not surprised, not yeah. surprised. That's superb. Wonderful. Glad you enjoy it. Okay, so next up is the hibiscus and vanilla strawberry sour. So for that, we're sticking with Sipsmiths, but we're going to use the strawberry smash, which is a flavour that you produce specifically for Wimbledon. This drink is served in a coupe glass or a martini glass. Personally, I prefer a coupe. Uh, as we serve these drinks without ice, it's a good idea to chill this glass down beforehand. So. A little ice and a little soda water and then pop that off to the side. It says a shaken cocktail again. So with the strawberry smash, we're going to put 50 mils. And then our citrus this time is lime and we're going to go with 25 mils of lime. And then around 10 mils of hibiscus syrup. And to kind of soften that and mellow that flavor, around 10 mils of vanilla. Now, because we want a really nice uh, thick foam head, I'm going to be using a product called a foamer. If you can't get hold of this, you can use egg whites, um, but this one is a vegan option, so it works better for us on the bars. And we're just going to drop one, two, three drops in there. Now, I'll add the ice and shake. So we're going to discard the ice and water. And then we're actually going to fine strain this one. That way we don't get any shards of ice into that drink. There we go. And then the garnish is some freeze dried strawberry. Just sprinkle it on the top there. There you go, Nick. Enjoy. Amazing. We're more quintessentially British and Wimbledon with having strawberry. Exactly. Oh, that is <laughs> sensational. Excellent. That's absolutely fantastic. I love the frozen strawberries on top as well. The foam is perfect. Oh, it's that's just a cracking a, drink. Yeah, it is. It's one of my favorites on the menu this year for sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Beautiful. Well done. Cheers. Okay, and the final drink that I'm going to demonstrate is actually a non-alcoholic drink. So when we develop menus with the Keith Prowse team and Wimbledon, obviously we need to uh, make sure we have balance on that menu. So we always look for uh, low and no alcoholic drinks. Made a lot easier for us with brands like the Sipsmith's Free Glider, which is a non-alcoholic gin. So for this drink, we're going to be using the non-alcoholic and it's a spritz serve, so in a nice large wine glass. Topped up with ice. 
pop that to the side and again it's a shake and drink so we're going to take 50 mils of the Sipsmith free glider and we're going to use pink grapefruit juice and we're going to go 50 mils of that also okay and then we're going to go 25 mils of lemon juice and then 25 mils of sugar syrup and that's just going to balance against the slight sharpness of that lemon juice. Add the ice and shake. And then finally, top with lemonade. and a pink grapefruit twist garnish. And there you go, the Free Glider Summer Spritz. There you go, Nick, the non-alcoholic cocktail. Give it a try. That's the thing of beauty, straight away. I think, yeah, we're asked more and more nowadays just to have non-alcoholic options, and that just looks stunning. Yeah, I think you know, the whole no-lo movement is huge these days, and you can't get away from it, nor, nor would we want to, but brands bringing out non-alcoholic versions of their spirits helps us out. Absolutely, absolutely. That is fantastic. Super refreshing. Do you mind if I keep it? Go for it. Right? Go for Thank it. You. Brilliant. Cheers, Alex. Cheers, Thanks Nick. so much. Thank you very much. Enjoy.